what's up guys this is the right and i am back to bring you to the next episode of my own play total war let's play as venice in the last episode i believe that's where we secured um copenhagen and we've also been doing lots of fighting against the dutch we've got fighting against the swedes fighting in north africa fighting in, in malta got an awful lot of things to do but we have no money so let's hit in turn and um, i think i'll probably be on for trying to capture Malta because then that will get rid of another faction and then we'll probably want to commit those forces into fighting around um, the Spanish homeland. Yep the Dutch are reinforcing their front line but there is a limit to what they can do. Probably I mean we do want to keep we need to keep the pressure up everywhere while also investing in our economy across the board. Sweden. I wonder if you want to go for Finland. Potentially. Oh, close. Close, but not quite. They're scamping around wondering what to do. If they lose Stockholm, they're probably going to lose um, an awful lot of their income. Probably go bankrupt and lots of those armies will begin to suffer high rates of desertion. However, if they take too long, we will sail and attack Norway. Catch their last city, but all of their troops will be destroyed. So... I think Sweden is definitely on the way out. The Mughals are getting ready to come at us. Because at some point we do have to invade the Middle East. That just has to happen. You have to invade the Middle East, you have to invade America. There's an awful lot of things to do. And here is rebelling, which is great. Let's see if... Yeah, let's don't worry about raiding here. Get this rate. Let's get you to sabotage the happiness building. School of poetry. Get rid of all this. Okay, so. Here on the European fronts, everyone's in pretty good shape. Let's upgrade you to a craft workshop. Send our rakes out to try and assassinate. There we go. Nice. We've got Conrad. This agent trying to assassinate Cornelis Comstock. Not, not a single one of their gentlemen is safe. Try to kill that priest. No, didn't get him either. But everyone here is ready to move up. Hanover. Are you ready to admit that you might have been overreacting all this time? Minus three, minus eight. Not yet. Bro, they're going to get some religious happiness. That's something at least. Send this agent over into this area. So here in Amsterdam we're still replenishing. Here in Copenhagen. You are not... Replenished, but if I sell you up to Norway, yeah, they've not got very much there at Norway. I could take you, fuck you aboard ship, go for Norway. We can use this army to garrison. There you go. That's that is adequate. Um, recruitment's ongoing. We probably want to deal with okay well, we've got sweden and we've got we're well, stockholm and valletta let's tie tie up valletta first because if we do capture valletta that destroys the knights of st john and that's just one more faction we don't have to worry about in the end turn phase um, although actually this army may may be part of my order 66 forces and get ready to start taking out some of these italian states that uh Stand against us. So we've got Savoy and the Italian states. We have to bear in mind, as soon as we do that, um, our allies are going to be very unhappy with us. So we... <laughs> that's the... Yeah, it's Order 66. We pull that trigger when we are just in full-on attack mode. So let's drop my foot artillery up. We're going to make one breach. So attack through. Howitzers. Boy, a little bit back. 
Well, my conscript to try and flank out wide. My marines storm the breach. Two on the right of them. Three on the left, because you've got lots of wall to play with. Two to back up my assault divisions. Cavalry probably out wide on the left. General will stick around in the center. So, uh, how it says, try and engage their mortars with round shot, I suppose. They're out of range for quick climb, so just try and. I suppose, really, you're better off, you are better off trying to go after their cavalry blob. And we're going to rely on overwhelming this mortar unit. So, when the time comes, we're just going to try and attack with such speed they're not going to, be able to concentrate their firepower in a way they might like you not is it not far enough i think because we've stood back a little bit that's causing problems twist around shot engage the regiment of horse just land round shot in there or even better actually Start attacking some of these units that are attempt going to attempt to defend the wall. <laughs> when that line infantry unit gets hit by the quick line, they're going to be awfully upset. But the breach is being made. They're getting ready to defend it. But yeah, this is why when we attack, we're going to attack at full speed from all directions at once so their mortars can't shoot at us are you actually firing other how it's a unit you are good well you've lost one gun team one of your gunners is bugging out interesting okay we've got our breach marines advance up slowly troops on the left you're going to go after that section of the wall well, troops on the right are going to go after that section of the wall. Troops on the left are going to go for here. Conscripts. Go out wide. These units are backing up my marines. Put artillery engage that port there. Because you're only firing one gun, you guys may as well just drop shots in the centre. This unit that can fire is my... You're my real hitters. So as soon as these guys start readying to fire... There we go. Run! Keep attacking the guys in the centre. Cavalry push up. Are you guys attacking that piece? No, you're not. I'm not attacking that bastion. Ooh, an errant cannonball. Flip <laughs> over and took out the mortar unit. Hmm. Looks like he's dead, Jenkins. Can you, man? Okay, get all my quick climbers aiming at the center. Marines commit. The first regiment of militia broken. Charge into the breach, Marines.
These conscripts go to try and swarm one unit of line infantry. These two units are firing well off, but they're going to form up. Ideally, you guys can crack open that bastion, they'll attack through this hole. Enemy cavalry is committing into the action. Another unit of enemy infantry. My marines will be able to hold. Okay, conscripts run up here and take position. And I've got a real scrap out here. We're going to let them throw themselves up against my marines. Uh, this infantry just grouped together. My marines... They're going down, but they will be exacting a terrible toll on the enemy, although it is incredibly tempting to rely on some attack ground quickly. I'm right here to try and go pa. Two men kill the line infantry. Kill the 5th Regiment. Ooh, you men form square because some cavalry's come out of the gate. So I've got any cavalry in the breach. Okay, let's see if the danger close quick line works. Bring my regiment of horseback. Misfire. Run my cavalry, run my general forward. So the other unit rushes into it, although you can fire a will. May have captured the buildings, huh? Excellent, just swarm up, especially if they're just going to let us climb up. Quick loan coming in, it's done some good damage to my own guys. Ceasefire, pick round shot, engage the line infantry in the center. You men form square, pull my marines back out of the breach. <laughs> yeah, eviscerating the enemy line infantry right here. Enemy provincial cavalry chasing down my general. Come on, Marines, fall back. Let them run into your squares. Right, general, stay away. Heavy cavalry attacked enemy provincial cavalry. get some of these men to occupy some of these buildings go get them conscripts excellent so my line infantry charge the breach out what I want you to do. They are doing it, but just slowly. 
We've made our secondary breach, but I don't think we're going to necessarily need it. I mean, my cavalry will attempt to try and break through it. Killing the first regiment of foot. Let's give them a unit of marines to help out. Capture the buildings, huh? Yeah, enemy cavalry charging in. That's why I want you just to... Just run into the buildings and just open fire at your own time. Okay, we've captured... Bring the cavalry back. Captured another building in the barracks. So we're starting to drop round shot onto the line infantry. You men push forward. My marines storming into the 1st Regiment. They can't take much more of this. Conscripts are going to pick away at the troops in the centre. Round shots coming in as well. When this conscript unit is set up, that square is going to become a killing field. Okay, let's start to divvy some of these units up. gone through these Venetian troops pretty rapidly. You know, must get shot away. I'm not sure why it's... Because these are just my conscripts. I don't ever expect them to do anything super good, but... They can just keep rattling off musket shots. They're not that bad, troops. Okay, this gatehouse is ours. Let's send some troops to capture it. The other two units just kill these infantry units here. Now it's ours. Cavalry run in. Come on, kill that last man of the fifth. There we go. Now charge into the rear of these troops defending the breach. This unit of infantry is just getting good artillery shots. This part of the command HQ is damaged, so destroyed. Send my heavy cavalry in to attack the mortars. New men charge downhill into the militia. Kill these poxy gunners. Slaughter them. They'll probably. If we can kill their general, they will break. And that will be that. Kill the general. Howitzers. Ceasefire. There we go. They broke. Let's see if we can kill that cursed Templar. Got him. Do you. Girolamo Borelli. Got him. I think there's everybody. Excellent. In you get, boys. Nice. Okay, that's another faction destroyed, which is always nice. Okay, let's get the building repaired. Let's get the, the army repaired. Get the fleet into the dock. Upgrade the dockyard. Awesome. So that's Valletta captured. Now let's get on with... Have you got anything more fun? I think you will do. Is that horse artillery? It is indeed. Okay. 
Let's attack Stockholm and deny Sweden their greatest center of capital. The next turn we'll attack Norway and that will be Sweden destroyed. All of my troops in Scandinavia will replenish and then they will invade Britain. And then that will be the end of that continent. And ultimately, I think the armies that have invaded Britain will push on towards the Americas and begin to attack the former European colonial holdings there and start to bring them into a greater Venetian Empire. Oh, rain, rain, rain. Unlimber the guns, unlimber the artillery, or the howitzers. Okay, let's select my line. Something like this. The only thing we know for sure is that our pikemen will go into the breach. Other than that, I'm probably going to want to scamper people around to try and open more gates. Actually, where is there? Dragoons, Cussier. Oh, there they are. Yeah, they are in there. They're just a bit out of range, really. Okay, let's speed up time and allow gates to be cracked open. Cursier, Dragoons, Swedish Dragoons. We may end up wanting to make two breaches to split the enemy fire. In which case, let's to get my howitzers to engage. See, they don't like being given orders with time compression. Howitzers don't care. Although, a couple of units of infantry have had their heads blown off by artillery fire. Sorry, fella. No, you still don't like it. Okay, pummel that section of the wall. Make, get ready to make our way in. Start. We may end up actually um, forming pockets around the walls to try to lure them out to be annihilated rather than doing a more of a conventional assault. They are, they are attempting to counter our artillery fire. It's not working tremendously well. 46%, 50, that one's 31. I think howitzers do fire slower. Or maybe they miss more. I don't know. One or the other. Okay, 65%. It's probably enough to advance one component of the line forward. This unit can also advance forward. Pikemen, infantry, skirmishers. Split the cavalry up just to try and open up some more options. If we can attack both the breaches, we can try and reduce the amount of troops that the enemy can have on the on the fire step trying to stop us from capturing the gates elsewhere. Let's make everybody run. Pikemen are getting annihilated by the mortar fire. That's to be expected. Ultimately just run them forward. Actually no, they can stay out here as bait. We need we need human form up your Sections. How it's fire. Focus on attacking the defenders here. Around shot. Uh, my foot artillery. Keep attacking this section of wall here. If I can get one unit to attack 
the very tippy top. That's where we can get the enemy to try and sally out of the wall. Sally out of the fort to try and defeat our You guys need to push up to like here. It's the second regiment of militia. You're about to make a breach. That's pretty nice. Send one unit onto the wall here. Ooh, lots of good kills here. Garrus and Lion are advancing to stop us. Ninety six cent. Try to see if I can make my infantry just sit over here and avoid being attacked by their line, because their line will kill ours. The enemy grenadiers are advancing towards our line foolishly. They might be very confident, but they're getting shredded. One sixth regiment, about face, present. Brave but foolish. Unfortunately, a few of us are kind of shuffling forward to try fight them manually. So this hasn't really worked, although it could. Concentrate fire. You guys just don't. Abandon your... <laughs> Start trying to extricate yourselves from this carnage and rely on our chemical weapons. Again, because it's raining. Still, we're just shredding uh, columns in the centre. Artillery... Shrapnel shot directly ahead. One gonna attack here, one quick climb gonna attack these. See this unit had orders to withdraw. And they're still attacking. Shot gone. No, have you reloaded? No, you're just going to sit there. Okay, I don't think you can fire because you might hit my men, but if I click to do round shot. Interesting. Come on, you men. Get down the step. Just get off of the, get off of the wall and run. That's what we want. Many, many Swedish troops falling. In that manner. Here we've got garrison lines. Are you good? You might make it. I don't think you would necessarily survive. We still want our. Oh, it says just to keep clearing them out. Okay, where's my pikemen? Bring them up. My pikemen can get in here now. 29, 45. A 13th regiment of foot, still scary. We 
you men just pull fire onto the militia. They should go. They're line infantry guards. So you don't want to fight them. You want to stay back here on mats and see what they do. They're wavering. Pikeman run, you man cease fire. Infantry to square up with the militia. Line infantry, your job is just to hold here to allow my Swiss mountain Jaegers time to get up here. Okay, here comes the enemy cavalry coming in. Unsurprisingly, it took this long for them to rout. They did quite well. In you go, pikemen. Yep, you men scale the walls. George can be a blocker for this unit. The real killing force is going to be my Swiss Jaeger once they mount the fire step. Let's begin stacking up line infantry units. Pikemen are great, but don't, don't do everything, especially when there's marines here. I'm actually going to make this unit route. These, I suppose they are Royal Swedish Dragoons, not just any old Dragoons. begin to push up here as well. See these guys and their air guns are going to start popping shots off, hopefully against the Swedish Dragoons. Got a couple of them. Okay, throw my line infantry unit in here. Switch my artillery to round shot to attack the Dragoons. Once you men mount the fire step, this front should break completely. Okay, they're broken, that's not a problem. Understandably, you're upset. Artillery engage the cuirassier in the centre. We're going to engage the infantry. Oh, the line infantry guards have pushed through to attack us here. They're probably going to get us. Okay, let's mass my cavalry here. attack here come some enemy royal swedish dragoons focus on the infantry try to clear them out get my general up in my regiment of horse to detach kill that one infantryman you kill that kill that. you got him the expat infantry gets set up in line this unit gets set up Cavalry march onto the field. Yeah, and surprisingly a few of these units are gonna gonna collapse. 
Okay, they withdraw these formations. Go back to shooting. This line infantry unit can probably withdraw as well. Now it says quick climb the breach. Kill the horse artillery, we don't need the general. It's only provincial camp. There's even a Cotier out here. They could do some damage. Begin pushing the line forward. Same with these grenadiers. There we go. Friendly fire be damned. Get my general out of the way. Missiles, get in here. Drabant guards. Ooh, ooh, actually, that's some spicy infantry. Might be better off keeping a unit back here. Bring my hussars in. Get this infantry unit in. to get a couple of these enemy units to break. Break, break, breaking. Not too bad, they're going to make their way in. Kill the enemy general, that's always nice. These units get in here. How it says Quick climb attack ground here. As long as you hold the square, those Draban guards are done for. Got some withering fire from the armory. Generals here ready to boost the men's morale. Infantry get up here to engage the enemy cavalry. Everybody just push. Enemy Cossier winning decisively, but we are whittling them down. Every cavalryman they lose is one they cannot afford to. Square. Storm forward. Amen. Get involved into that action. Excellent. You're going to get bogged down, matey boy. Pikemen are coming in. You know, over here, who's that? Light infantry guards, mountain troops. Yeah, not enough. Too little, too late. Let's try to see if we can head them off. Push through. We can get the last of the currency air. Everybody else advance through formation. Okay, you set up like so. Maybe let's put another unit out here. General back them up. We can ignore this garrison line unit. Plagueman, kill that last garrison airman.
you're going to stand here and square off against those troops coming in from the back. Gunners just attack ground. That infantry unit is rejoining the fight, but I don't think they've got enough strength to actually make a difference. These men have not abandoned the gate, which is good for us in the end. Attack the Drabant guards. Sweden may have extracted a toll from us, but there's not a huge amount they can do about it. Here come the seventh foot guard. They've smashed one of my line units, but I don't really care about that. Human reload and just pour fire onto them. Hey, their infantry did a reverse assault and attacked my mountain troops. I don't think it's going to be enough. That's not a particularly good formation to maximise your firepower, Sweden, I must admit. One Dragoon Guard left. Some of my mountain troops have escaped. See, the line of tree guards are doing a good job. Just not enough of a good job, I'm afraid. Your capital has fallen. It's nice of you guys to stay back here, though. Awesome. So that's Stockholm. Next turn will be Norway. So we've lost one infantry unit, but we should be able to hold on to this. So you men might actually make way for this force to garrison the city itself. Continue to replenish. Let's get rid of the university. Get everything else repaired. Do you have any religious schools we can knock down? Don't think you do. Yes, you do. Boom. And my spy is on the way down here anyway. Lots of troops scampering around here, although I'm fairly sure they're going to be suffering from bankruptcy pretty soon. Uh, but that's them dealt with. Let's upgrade a couple of our economic buildings. Let's make sure that our infrastructure upgrades are ongoing. You're probably not needed anymore on this front. You can start the march towards Copenhagen. You need to hold... You, you, these guys are going to hedge against this army. But once Sweden is destroyed, they will be freed up. Let's upgrade a couple more of our industry buildings here. Don't think we're ready to abandon... Well, abandon. <laughs> leave this territory yet. Let's move you up to the frontier. Mr. Sabatini needs to replenish because you're not ready to attack. Once these are ready, we're going, to be, we're going to push west towards Tangier. Then we'll all push on to Gibraltar. Then we're into Spain proper. This is going to carry on staying the way it is because they're replenishing. Really, we want Hanover to become more comfortable with our rule. Don't think you're ready to accept it yet. No, you are not. Let's recruit a couple of units of Dragoons. 46,000. Okay. I think this fort down here, where the where there's a massive amount of Maratha, not Maratha, Mughal troops massing. Let's just spam out as many line infantry units as we can in one turn just to build up this garrison. And we do really want to start building up invasion, or at least not necessarily invasion armies, but something a little more robust than what we currently have down here. Camels, SR unit, let's get a unit of heavy cavalry. 
Don't mind if it's going to take a while to get here. Come on, let's get some. I think that's three units of artillery should be being recruited. Yep, there, there's the third. So it's going to be 12 pounders all the way. A lot of lag trying to get that in that I want. I guess some African light infantry mercenaries. There we go. Croatia's got a port upgraded. We've got a port that we can upgrade. There's another one, wasn't there? Sevra Morse. Let's upgrade you, because I'll just forget. Magdeburg's got a seminary. Hamburg's got the Jesuit College. Everything's coming up rather nice. Okay, Lithuania, everything's upgrading. Everything's upgrading there. As one gets a steam power cloth mill. Up to 4,000. Don't think there's a huge amount. Nothing critical I can do right now. You're punishing? Yes, you are. Good. As are you. Cool. Let's... No tech on the... Actually, there is some tech. Steam engine or threshing machine, but then they'll go straight on to interchangeable parts, which is fine. Okay, more troops being recruited. So the main thing will be what does Sweden do? Do they continue to kind of freak out and run around? Uh, they are going to... Oh, I'm going to have to fight this manually because this army will pop out. And if we auto resolve, this army will get badly damaged. So let's do it. Let's fight the remnants of their garrison manually. They have given us no choice. Don't be afraid. <laughs> His last words before being killed in battle. Don't worry, bro. I'll be fine. Bang. Whoops. I suppose not. Oh well. So once we take Amsterdam, that will be the Netherlands... Well, it won't be their last big city, because they still have... Uh, they have Paris. Okay, all my small units. Your most... The biggest thing they have to worry about is being mobbed by enemy cavalry rather than infantry. Although, to be fair, there's not very much of that to worry about. Something like this. The rest of it, just the rest of my army, just kind of chill out. Something like this. Yeah, their army's rather small. Should just let them fire a round shot. Where's my other 12 pounder? May as well limber them. Or may as well unlimber them. Shrapnel shot. Yeah, that'll that'll do it. Trap shop's gonna wipe out that provincial cab unit, that's for sure. I love shrapnel, so when it explodes here, it just goes through their entire formation. This regiment of horse are running at us. They've got Blood in their nostrils. That's right, come get us. Teach us a lesson. Oh, yeah. Volleys ripping through their formation. Yeah, 
it's the end of you. <laughs> well, this unit, they're, they're brave. Next pack infantry are on the advancing forward. Blunderbuss shotgunners are trying to find a way to get into the action. Okay, the last unit. There we go. It was that unit. That's who you're protecting. Marines, expat infantry. This cavalry is going to be dealt with by my core of actually decently sized infantry. Oh, they just got eviscerated. last regiment of horse. I think my howitzers need to just pick it off. I don't know, it will just be that unit of cavalry. Because when they've gone, which they will do soon, yeah, they're gone. Just one unit of heavy cavalry. Just attack there. So you shoot their artillery, their cavalry. My cavalry is just gonna hopefully wipe them out. We might just break and run as well because you've got artillery coming in, but this should be over regardless. <laughs> yeah, not so fast. Although, they're not gonna suicide charge into us, no sir. <laughs> Man, at least that's over. But yeah, the main thing was there's an army that's stuck inside the fort. They will pop out. And they're full strength, ready to rock and roll. So we didn't want to auto-resolve. Otherwise, we would be in a much weaker position. Hey, we're being dual... Oh my god. Peter van Muschenbrock is better at both. Let's go with the gun. Problem is with these, you can never bloody well tell, seemingly... Which one your guy is? Because my guy should be the red guy. Him. <laughs> should be the red guy. Right. He's just ran away in disgrace. Why not? Did he kill him? Maybe he did. There'll be another one spawning soon. Hey, they've actually retreated from Amsterdam. That's pretty handy. They're going to try and flank around, but we have another army ready. You're going to try and do something incredibly clever, but it's not going to work because we're going to attack Norway and destroy your entire faction. Um, yeah, they're going to have to deal with soon. They've probably got an army of protectorates, as they usually do. Right, let's get ready. Let's get spending. Enemy raid and rock dam, that is absolutely fine. Ultimately, we've got. Actually, make sure. Yeah, we hit you. Replenishing. Okay, we could probably do worse than you. Actually, how far can you reach? You can hit them. Awesome. Right, firstly. Let's get some infrastructure upgraded. 
hundred thousand. So we have got lots of money. Let's make sure we keep cascading the tax base. Invest in our tax base, make more money, invest in the tax base, and so on and so on and so on. Lubeck, build a sloop. You're all good. We riot in Sardinia, but they then should chilled out. Let's recruit a pikeman unit just to hold hash their beans somewhat. Ultimately, if they do want to try and get around us, it won't be long for this army in Algiers to be able to leave. So let's actually recruit some militia. If they want to try and flank around to the south, they are welcome because it leaves. Oh, come on. It didn't like that. It leaves the path, the road to Morocco, open. I really didn't want to do that. Very weak army here. You will fight it. Right, workers have rioted in Corlin, but they've immediately chilled out. Workers on strike in Sweden, fair enough. Mr. Balbus, just replenish. Mr. Ferretti. Let's recruit a Lily unit of Marines. But ultimately, the main thing we want to do here is take this army and attack Norway. We destroy the garrison, that's the end of Sweden. But looking at the timer, I believe it's time to end the episode. So, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you've enjoyed. And we'll see you next time for the continuing adventures of Venice. Cheers, everyone.